Alright, here we go. Dang it. I wonder. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. Okay. Oh, there's a fish. Can you see? He has his eyes closed. Hmm. In Zora's domain. Get the last sword. Before we get the last dungeon.
You capture something in the bottle. Then, while, you, while the bottle is blue, you jump off. You hit the item you want to use, or you hit the bottle, then the item you want to use. I think it is. Let me try it. Yeah. And then you clean up greener. You don't have to have the ocarina to do this though. Just see a second reason why later. I guess we can get two heart pieces before switching over. Do the next side quest thing. Basically, we'd get the Zora's domain. What's up there? Do I have that one? Okay. So all the rest of those hearts are heart pieces. I just have the two easy to get it. Sadly. behind that big ice pillar thing. <clears throat> but you can't do anything with that unless if you're a kid. And I'll show you later in the extras. Also if you didn't unfreeze Zora, you can't do this. Uh, 
Yeah, I think you can't use a teleporting stone. Otherwise, it will spoil. So, if you're a little boy. How do we pot? Trying to debate what the fastest way here is. Um. It is to go through here. And they get lost. Climbling, climb. There's no way I'm going to make it. The good news is they don't make you start from the uh, one spot. Uh oh. we do is talk to him again. I'm gonna try I'm gonna try the warp song. I think it just automatically spoils it. From my experience. Yep. I don't know why that happened. Get it. 
Oh, there's a gold skatula here too. That's strange. Oh, right. That's gonna be something in the extra though. I mean, I probably could have killed it. Yeah, I give you a lot of time for this. Oh, thank goodness. Be right back, guys. 